Hey our parent bakers, today we are here with another race event. It's called a Bouncing Time. Um, it seems like the main concept is using the Ultra Dragonauts and Dragonauts to beat the race. Let's see how well we do. Do we have any farming? Only farming we have is seems to be Boat and Engineer. So I think I'm going to lead off with Thada. Do you have a free one of these? Where do I put this? I guess I put it here. I could put it over here. I think I put it over here. And then we start and we send the next two waves. Then we can send another wave. And now we try to get this to this upgraded. Let's send more waves. We don't have any good crowd control right now. This can be farmed. Farming. Get deconstruction. I think we're gonna be getting spike pot on this now. With very quick shots. Get another one over here. Actually, let's get one behind it. Because this one can be enhanced eyesight sight with spike pot. And then we can get another spike pot right here with very quick shots. We can just send waves. Get those popped, and then let's upgrade Sadata to a Juggernaut so I can pop those. Just keep sending waves. Now we do need something for the mob coming up. Well, first things first, uh, wait, can this cover the entire thing? It can't, okay. So I think we put it like right, this one like right here. Get it to advanced intel and we're gonna probably use this to pop the mob. And then we'll use something like right here for farming. Just keep sending the mobs here. Let's get another Ultra Juggernaut. No, Ultra Juggernaut, just a regular Juggernaut. Now we have multiple regular Juggernauts. Let's get um, Merchantmen so we can start having money out there. Let's get this to beginning of the path. And then get our favorite trades. And then just keep sending. Get armor piercing dots now. And then let's get a uh, more glaze. And let's keep sending. We need something to attack DDT. Yes. Um, I guess we just go for an ultra juggernaut. But I don't think we do any of those for ultra juggernaut. I think we do one like right here. And then let's get a uh, pancake here, set to strong. Full auto, large cow bear. And then let's get it so it can attack camos. And let's get another one over here so we can get primary mentoring and just allow everything over there to attack camos and just send more. We do have a ALK, so we can actually ALK buff everything, which I think will be a good idea. And now I think we just save up for some better things. Let's go to wave 79 though. Elite Defender. And let's try to get a Glaive Lord. Set this to close. Because they'll always be attacking into that. Sending those waves. Now we have a Glaive Lord. 
And now I just get, I guess we just get more um, juggernauts. Let's get these juggernauts buffed though. Oh, we can also get Premier Expertise, which I think would be our next go. Let's completely sweep these, hopefully. Okay, we popped them. The DDTs are dead now, so let's see if we can... We cannot go on to the next one, because these uh, ZRMGs are too powerful, and we don't want to get overwhelmed by DDTs. But we can actually get primary expertise. Let's surround this thing with um, juggernauts, though. Because the more juggernauts, the merrier. Luckily, DDTs have barely more HP than normal Moab. Get this one to quick shots. Let's get some of these to quick shots. Let's just send more. Let's go to wave 99. Wait for the DDTs to be dead. There we go. Don't think we have much we can do, so I'm just gonna upgrade this to a intelligence bro. I think we just send the mad now. Let's see how well we do. Let's see if we can kill this um, bad. I think we just can. There we go. Anyone, this is what the map looked like afterwards. We have so, so many uh, juggernauts. Um, I hope you guys enjoyed the video. Uh, please le make sure to leave a comment, like, and subscribe if you want more. Also, turn on that bell notification. And see you in the next one. Bye-bye!